So hi and welcome to this Python 101 video. So um, basically before I get started I just want to apologize for there being such a, um, a big gap between uh, Python videos because it's been something ridiculous like seven or eight months and um, the reason for that is there actually isn't really a good reason. Uh, I just decided to focus on other series like, or series like um, YouTube, I mean how do you make your own YouTube or uh, learn JavaScript or learn PHP or something like that as opposed to the Python one. So for that I apologize and I'm going to start making these videos again um, because I decided whenever I made the uh, how to make your own domain extension uh, series that I kind of wanted to start doing the old series that I did again. That I didn't want to just make how to make your own YouTube videos, I wanted to make other ones. So that's what we're going to be, we're going to be uh, learning in Python today, how to um, make your, or how to make a button for your window. Like we, in the last video we uh, created our own window and in this video we're going to be adding a button to a window. Uh, also this video is in 720p like all the rest of my videos have been recently. So this is the first Python 101 video in 720p HD. So this just means that I can make the text bigger um, and it should be clearer overall. And one final thing is I'm using Python 3.3.2 as opposed to Python 2.7 and that's just because the last the reason I decided to use Python 2.7 in the last uh, the last time I made the videos is because um, I thought there was a uh, better well I, there is actually better uh, library support in Python 2.7 but Python 3 is um, well we don't it, Python 3 is uh, going to be the new standard soon so we have to start using it and also uh, we're not we don't actually use any libraries really in these videos so it doesn't really matter to us anyway so let's get started with the video uh, today so today we're going to be doing is creating a button on our uh, window in Python. So what, that's, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to type in from t uh, kinter which is the library uh, import all uh, which is the wee asterisk and what uh, this basically says is just import everything from the t kinter library. Uh, in the last um, video I made um, on Python on how to make a window in Python the uh, t kinter I think had a capital T because in Python 2.7 it has a capital T like this but in Python 3 it's a lowercase t. Uh, then what we want to say is uh, create a variable called master and set it equal to tk. So just ignore that for now, that doesn't really matter. Um, that just basically means uh, this is like the tk is sort of just our window, think of it like that, and then the master is just the variable we're assigning to it. Uh, and then what we want to say is we want to say button equals uh, the button function and uh, the button function has a capital B uh, and the button function is three parameters. The first one is master which is the variable we created up here. Second one is what we want the text on the button to be uh, to say. So what I'm going to say is text equals close window and then finally command equals uh, close window. And what the command is, is just a function that we want to run whenever the button's clicked. And then what I have to do is I have to say uh, button.pack, which just adds it to the window. And then I have to say main loop, which is just a function called main loop that I want to run, which basically just means our program is going to run. Uh, and then up here I actually have to define the um, function close window. So I say def close window. And then what I want to say is exit. So what this does is it creates a window, puts a button on the window that says close window. Whenever I click the button, it runs this command, which is a function called close window, and it exits uh, the program. So if I hit F5 now, as you can see now we have um, a window in the corner up here. Whoops, uh, let's just bring this down. And if I click on close window, it says you sure you want to close the program, still running, click OK, and it, it closes everything out. So that's it for this Python 101 video. I know it's been quite short, but that's all we wanted to cover in this video. It was uh, just how to uh, create a button on your window. So once again, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And I will be making way more Python 101 videos. And once again, I apologize for the lack of videos for the last couple of months on Python 101. So uh, once again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.